you've done a number of things for kids over the years uh, because you had kids, I assume. Mm-hmm. And you were just writing songs for kids? Well, or that wasn't because why. you in Brooklyn and Dan Zane's in Brooklyn, there's this thing about people who we were just write rock Dan songs. Zanes. I didn't mean that. <laughs> we were just looking to chisel it's out in the water, market share it? from Dan Zane. You know, the whole thing about the kids' music is we, we didn't really have a plan to be to be a kids' act. You know, we, we, we uh, did it as sort of a side project while we were doing a lot of other stuff. Like you do like a Christmas album or something. It was, yeah. a, it was a one-off. It was a one-off. <laughs> that our, our, our CD No, uh-huh. uh, which came out uh, eight years ago, I guess. Um, and... Uh, you know, we we were just really startled by by the re- response that it got because we'd put out a, a, a you know an art- artistically integral adult you know highly calculated you know our best work kind of rock record the same year and 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 it was outsold like two to one by the kids record so we suddenly thought oh I guess we have this other job now you know it was not something we were fantasizing about for ourselves. Well, what happens at concerts? Do people bring their toddlers? Well, that's actually, that's a, that has proved to be problematic because the parents that think taking children to bars are exactly <laughs> the wrong ones to be making that decision. Um, uh, basically, our, like, we're do, you know, we're doing, we're doing a show at the Beacon in, I guess, a week or so. And, um, you know, that's a theater and that'll be an adult show. It's, it's extremely loud. There's no dancing there. But, um, you know, still, I think, you know, the, the, when we do kids, sh- when we do kids shows, they're like special events. It's like it's no secret. We have a our our live our regular live performances is, is swear tastic, and uh, you know it's and we're in places that just shouldn't there shouldn't be kids, and usually at a time when kids shouldn't be up. But you know, for a group that a group two guys, mm-hmm. oh well, but we, a group we've got of a two great, guys, we've got a great band uh, who plan to be together for a very long time. This yeah. can be seen as a, a very brilliant tactic because you teach them the ABCs and then later yeah, uh, they, I guess so. they, you know, when they grow up, it's, it, they wind up coming to the other country. Yeah, I guess the, the, those kids maybe haven't gotten old enough yet for us to test that theory, but there are kids who are, you know, in their teens now who saw us, pl- uh, uh, they saw our work on Tiny Tunes like 17 years ago or whenever that was. Yeah. Um, oh, I guess they're in their 20s by now.